Hey guys, so I'm fishy here and addicted to fishing. And we're gonna go hit this. So Looks like it's gonna rain. I don't think it's gonna really rain. It's probably just gonna drizzle. But um, yeah, it's probably gonna be windy and everything, guys. I have to leave the microphone behind because uh, you have to have that door, that, that port open, and with the rain, cables, microphones, it's not really a good idea. So. If you guys hear nothing but music from here on out, that means the wind kicked up. <laughs> it's drizzling guys, it just started drizzling. We just got down here, so let's see how it goes. Woo! You got him in the tongue, fool. Trevor. What happened? He stabbed himself more? Guess what's wrong with the striper? Baby striper. We're not even gonna count it. <laughs> oh, <laughs> come on, bro. <laughs> He smack him right on the rock. <laughs> I literally took seven jerk baits out on my 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 tackle box right now. I said, nope. I don't care if I don't catch no fish. I'd rather just not catch babies. They're not crazy. Though. You see him swimming away? No. What do you do? He's like swimming like this. Like he's like. You got all jacked up. How would you swim? <laughs> I thought you throw. I uh, hate throwing jerk baits, fool. What happened? <laughs> Just need the right rod, the the, the nice uh, lighter line. You you should step down to eight pound, fool. The jerk bait gets more action. Yeah. Most people throw it. It broke off. I can't do it with this. It's, it hits the floor. Nah, fool. He's, I'm going to disenfranchise you because I, cause I didn't want to bring my spinning reel and took out all my jerk baits right when you say, when you say, well, I'm going to go over here for a little bit. I was like, let me rest. <laughs> I wanted to rest so I could come early in the morning and hit the bass right here. They'll be all right here, fool, swimming in school, trying to pin up the, the shad. It's a pattern, homie. It's a pattern. Every year, it's like, fool, you don't even need electronics. You want to come hit. Or you could just hit jerk bait like you. Give me the other one, fool. Huh? <laughs> I said, give me the other one. Oh, oh, oh! What? Five? You had some followers? <laughs> so Nestor got another little baby. He's playing with him. Get him off the right way. Stop messing with him. Put him back in the water if you're not keeping him. I don't like jerk baiting with my big caster rod, especially my 7.3. It's way too long. And then it's stiff. I'm gonna lose a lot of fish, so I'm gonna back off my drag. Too stiff. But I got an 8 pound, eight pound mono leader. So, hopefully, the little stretch helps me negate too many fishes coming off from overpowering them. Or it would have been clean. I haven't even tested out that, that new rod I got. I just have it sitting in the garage. That one I showed you I paid five bucks for? Yeah. You think? I got hit right off the back. What? I'm throwing a, 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 I literally swam a paddle tail through there 50 times. Gives them time for them to think about it, huh? See it? Yeah. But look how 
awkward it is. And then when my anti reverse is starting to you feel that, or you see that? Yeah, it's starting to give a little bit. But that's because I'm not, I haven't cleaned it. It probably got like sediment, you know, because those, it's just roller bearings that when they pull up, they tighten up, you know? Clean them and oil them. Sometimes when they, you get it too wet, grease gets in them and that causes them not to lock up. Yeah, but I feel like I can't work the jerk bait properly with the bait caster. Yeah, because you're not moving it right. See? How are you gonna be just landing left and right? Not I'm throwing like jerk bait too. I'm not working it right. <laughs> oh. There it goes. Just needed a longer pause. It got me so close too. Look, double up. Cheers. Yeah, a little bit less. They grow quick. Job, Nestor. That's the biggest one of the night. Nestor's on with a nice striper. Nice belly. Whoa! You, you a chunky guy. I got molested by a human. <laughs> He's gonna have a. Uh, what do you call that? Weight issues now. Fish on. That one looks good. Is he just far or is he a good one? Nestor, you're back on the groove, huh? Yeah, make me feel like throwing down the fucking rat trap. He's throwing the tube, man. What's going on with you? It's a nicer one. It's about a pound though. No? Oh look, he's been munching full. You see how fat he is? Oh, right in his eye. Fish out. It was on the floor the whole time. And then I just popped it. Feel like a good one. That's a decent one. Did I stab you in the mouth? So sorry about that guy. There it is, guys. So, right as I turn off my camera so I can mark my last fish, Nestor lands this one. And I said, how come you didn't say fish on? He says, I said, got him. Got him sounds like shot him, all right? You guys see it? Where's he at? Let me get him. <laughs> They're all babies. No one cares about that. It's baby napper over here. My batteries are real low, so I gotta get close. Look down there. Nice. 